Mayor Harry Rilling joined local trade unions at a job fair on Friday to focus on some of the state's fastest growing occupations, union jobs. If you're unemployed for a period of time, you feel that you don't have any hope, you feel that there's no chance for you to be gainfully employed, and you're looking and you're looking, but sometimes you're not looking in the right area. So there's the area right here. 11 labor management trust schools were on hand in the community room at Norwalk City Hall to speak to men and women interested in training for occupations in carpentry, plumbing, electricity, and other construction trades. This is the first mayor in a long time here in Norwalk who also believes in project labor agreements um, on uh, municipal projects, which is really important um, because the quality of work is much higher and the results you get is much better. Well, these schools are all involved with the building trades and what they are are tickets to the middle class. So someone enters a program, they don't need to know anything, uh, they get a tuition free training for generally four or five years in a skilled craft, they earn money from day one. So you start as an apprentice and they teach you everything, they send you to school, they give you an education, everything so it's great, the benefits are great. The idea of a trade union job fair came about by local advocate Martha Dumas. The more I can get the young men off the streets and working, the better our community is. The Connecticut Department of Labor has identified union jobs as growing. Vinny Valente, program manager for the Office of Partnership and Training at the State Department of Labor, says training is an essential part of a qualified worker. They'll go through a four or five year training program, which is we used to call the original four year degree. And their value is ten to twenty thousand dollars of scholarship for free. And at the end of the process, they have good middle class jobs. Once you reach that four year, five year period where you get your certificate, you're still young enough to start your own. Opportunities are available to those age 18 and over. For more information on becoming a trade worker, visit www.ctapprenticeship.com. In Norwalk, I'm Priscilla Lombardi for It's Relevant News.